What's up everyone, Base Senpai here. Thank you everyone for uh, subscribing to my channel. I just hit 1,000 subscribers. Uh, it's been a long time. Um, overall, really excited with the channel. Uh, really appreciate all the feedback, all the support I get. Um, and I am here to give you two videos today. One is a collection video and the other is just how I got into anime and manga. That will be up uh, shortly after this one or before this one, depending on which is done first. Uh, I'm currently, well, I've upgraded the collection, as you guys can tell. I got an extra bookcase, and books are stacked on top of each other. I was sitting at 800 volumes in my last collection video, and currently I'm just under 1,200. Uh, so definitely a sizable increase since the last video. Um, I really can't show much, well, the whole bookcase, because I have this freaking computer that's blocking um, the shot so I'm gonna do the best I can to show you the whole collection um, I'm gonna tell you what's ongoing if it's complete or not uh, sorry about the glare I really can't do anything Florida is sort of wonky with weather uh, but let's get started I'm gonna try to keep this under 30 minutes so um, and uh, the first shelf is gonna be a little out of order because I have books on top of books so First off, 20th Century Boys. I need to get into the series. I haven't read it yet. I've only heard good things about it. So uh, by next year, hopefully I'll have the full collection and I've read it. Alice in Murderland, Volumes 1 and 2. This is not up to date. I think Volume 3 is out. Uh, I just got it mainly because the covers the covers are really cool looking and you know I'm not really into shoujo, but uh, they looked really cool. So definitely checked it out. Black Bullet Light Novel Volume 1, I believe Volume 3 is out. Overall, just like the anime, picked up the Light Novel, nothing much to it. Um, Black Lagoon Volumes 1 to 10, this is up to date. Um, volume 10 was recent, probably released like a couple months ago. Uh, overall, the series is pretty good. If you like a seinen action series with guns and mobs and shit like that, you'll definitely like that one. Uh, then we have Blade of the Immortal, um, volumes 1 to 31. This is complete. This series is um, awesome. It's really well done. Uh, it got recommended to me by co-provider. I actually got this uh, series for a steal. I got it on Craigslist for like 50 bucks, uh, which was super good because Dark Horse manga individually is like $13, and some of these are out of print. So I definitely got a good good steal on it. Uh, before I continue, I just got some extra volumes from Amazon, Gantz 1 and 2, One Piece 77, and Fairy Tale 49. Next, we have A Certain Magical Index, volumes 1 and 2. These are light novels. I still just haven't gotten the rest of uh, the light novels. I sort of took a break from light novels. I had a bunch that I still have to read, so I figured let's not get any more. Citrus, volume 1 to 4. This is up to date. Uh, my new favorite Yuri series as of late. Uh, overall, really good. If you're not into, uh, if you haven't read Citrus yet, I definitely recommend it. The artwork is really good. Um, I just, I, I like the artwork. It's very uh, pleasing and definitely, in my opinion, some of the best Yuri artwork out there. Granted, I haven't seen much, so take my opinion with a grain of salt. Uh, Die Were Gelder. This is by the manga who did um, Blade of the Immortal. Haven't read it yet, but it's a very violent, supposedly, and it's by uh, it's just about a bunch of girls who are assassins and stuff. I don't know. I, I don't know the specifics on it, but supposedly it's good, so I'm gonna check it out. Dore Doro, one to five, really good stuff. I uh, got recommended to me by uh, NZ Anime Manga. Uh, can't say much about it I wish I can get more I think volume 6 was out of stock for a while but now it's in stock and then just my luck volume 7 is now out of stock so uh, I'm gonna be trying to get this as soon as possible so I can continue doubt volumes 1 and 2 this is like an omnibus they're like 3 in 1 omnibuses um, it's like I touched this I touched on this on my last collection video it is pretty much the Saw of Japan. It's pretty much like the movie Saw 2 in, in manga form. It's pretty cool. Uh, if you like horror and you like uh, psychological thrillers, definitely check that one out. Gangsta, one of the six. One of my favorite seinen's uh, currently. Overall, can't complain. Artwork's fantastic. Characters are really cool. 
drugs, violence, uh, explicit content. That's that's everything you need in a Sane manga. Good night, pun pun. I have no idea what this is about. Got recommended to me, and hopefully uh, I read it soon. I've heard very good things. I think on my anime list, it's ranked three on all time manga. So definitely can't wait to get into that. Uh, some things on the top. Some Toriko volumes, uh, 10 to 32, that's up to date, Triage X, 1 to 8, uh, the others are on the other shelf. Uh, Toriko is my hands down favorite, current favorite uh, shonen battle manga right now, it is so good. Uh, if you haven't read it or even checked it out, uh, definitely, definitely check it out, it's so good. Sorry about the books, I feel like the book should be on the back and not on the cover even though the words would be upside down. It's just how I, I have to treat the book. Sorry about that. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, uh, Adventure Parts 1 and 2. Uh, this one, Part 1's complete. This has two more volumes left. Uh, can't wait for more. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. I'm sort of waiting to get all of them before I start reading them. I actually just got the last volume on my Kindle, so I may actually check that out soon. Uh, but definitely, hopefully, maybe they bring over Parts 4. Uh, and three, at least in the hardcover, that'd be really cool. Is it wrong to try to pick up Girls in a Dungeon? This is the three light novels. Uh, fourth one's probably out. Um, I like it. It's good. I've only read the first one. Uh, but uh, just light novels are sort of hit and miss with me. I'd rather read a real book. But light novels are really cool too. I definitely need to check out more. Judge 1 to 6 is by the same uh, mangaka who did Doubt. It's pretty much... Um, don't know how to describe it, but it's just a bunch of people in a room and they're trying to judge and kill each other off, trying to kill off the bad guy, whatever. I don't know who it is, but overall, it, it's sort of not very good in the beginning, but it gets actually pretty pretty good around here. It actually has a really good plot twist that I like, so definitely check it out if you're into horror psychological stuff. Log Horizon Light Novel Volume 1. Uh, I like the anime. Picked up one of the light novels, haven't picked up the rest. Not much to say about that. Message to Adolf. This is by Osama Tezuka. Uh, these are the only Osama Tezuka works I have. I haven't read them yet. But I figured I'd get them because they're probably going out of print soon. Because vertical hardcovers don't stay in stock uh, very much. Uh, pretty much the reason why I got Bubble Suit Gun in the Origin. Volumes 1 to 12 complete. I had to do it. I'm not, I read one volume, but I know they're going out of print. So, and these things are beautiful. These are the best hardcovers you can possibly get um, confirmed. Like, there's no, you can't do better than that. So, definitely pick that up while you can still get it. Uh, the remaining stuff of, uh, remaining few volumes of Triage X. Trinity 7 won the 4. Overall, really good harem. I think it's one of the best harems out right now, uh, but that's my opinion. Uh, World Trigger 1 to 9. Hard to see, I know. Um, I haven't even read it. Well, I've read a few volumes of it, but I want to get back into it. Anime is doing well, so. Your Lion April Volume 1. Um, overall, I really didn't like the artwork in this series. I know people like it, uh, but overall, I just I just didn't. Yamuna Kun and the Seven Witches 1 to 4. I like this series. It's a nice gender bender romance stuff a little etchy but i can't complain uh the disappearance of nagano yuki chan won the six i can't say much about this either it's it's all right i won't continue getting it though and then Yu-Gi-Oh! duelists won the three i want to get the rest of it but i don't know and let's just finish off the top here toriko won the nine like i said about toriko some spice and wolf volumes eight to eleven Taboo Tattoo, I did a recommendation on it. I sort of want to revise it because I sort of said it was good, but after getting some feedback, I realized maybe it wasn't as good as I thought it was. Um, the Kurosagi Corpse Delivery Service. This, these are three-in-one omnibuses, as you can tell. I don't want to pull them out, but they just sort of um, snapped the three books together. So it, quality's not there, but I don't know. They're cheap, and it's gory. I don't know. You're like into that stuff. Uh, Tokyo ESP and Toradora. Sorry about this. I hate the top bookshelf because I'm getting my head is. I just don't like uh, with my arms above my head. So I'm gonna try to get these through. Monster one to seven. Two more volumes. 
Love Monster, can't wait to finish it. Um, no Game, No Life, Light Novels 1 and 2. Uh, I like it. Um, need to get more, there's like four out. Uh, Planets by Makoto Yukimura. This is the, by the guy who did Vinland Saga. So, I mean, if Vinland, Vinland Saga is good, this has to be good. Um, definitely check this one out. Um, Prison School 1 to 3. I love Prison School. I just did a recommendation on it. Check it out. Strike the Blood light novel. Mm. I like the anime. I haven't read the light novel. Probably will eventually, though. Sword Art Online light novels 1 to 5. Volume 6 is out. Um, eh. I, I enjoy Sword Art Online. I'm not in love with it though. So, Terraformers 1 to 11. This is another series that I really enjoy. Characters are awesome. Rome. Oh, Rome's a beast. But, um, Terraformers, if you haven't looked into it, definitely check it out. I like it. So, The Devil is a Part Timer light novel. Um, I really enjoyed the anime, so I figured get the light novel. I haven't read it yet though. You're going to see a, a lot of that with, uh, in this series that I just ha I haven't read a lot of the light novels so The Isolator this is by the manga who did Sword Art Online it's a hardcover uh, another light novel haven't read it yet uh, eventually will it's by the guy who did Sword Art Online so I, it's probably above average so The Sacred Blacksmith 1 to 6 I stopped collecting the series it just wasn't doing it for me anymore Tokyo Ghoul um, honestly I I like Tokyo Ghoul, but I really haven't read past Volume 7 yet. Like, I'm sort of waiting. I didn't want to read it online, and I'm sort of waiting for the print volumes. Uh, I don't know. Tokyo Ghoul is still really cool. I, I definitely enjoy it. Did not like the anime, though. Ubel Blot, 1 to 4. This is technically covering Volumes uh, 1 to 10. It's like uh, Berserk's cousin, so if you like Berserk, definitely give this a shot. It's pretty good. Definitely gory medieval it has literally the same vibes as uh, berserk does ultraman volume one mm, i'm not really in the mechs but i don't know the artwork seemed good and i'll get around them reading it eventually vagabond one to seven i don't know why i don't have the rest of these volumes honestly like this is my second favorite manga of all time i literally do not know why i don't i've read a few of them online but the artwork Hands down, best artwork in anime. I mean, manga. Sorry about that. Um, overall, this series is... If you haven't read Vagabond yet, you're you're missing out. That's all I can say. And Vinland Saga, to finish out the hard, the bigger ver the volumes and the hardcovers. Uh, Vinland Saga, number three manga of all time. Uh, I love Vinland Saga. Vinland Saga is so good. Uh, they just uh, released these two volumes. I haven't read them yet. Um, but I'll get around to it. I have a bunch of stuff I'm trying to catch up on. 12 Beast. Uh, this series is done by the guy who does Monster Masume. It's just your standard etchy manga. Uh, nothing really else to say about it. Uh, if you like etchy stuff, check it out. A Certain Scientific Railguns, Volume 1 to 10. Uh, I like the manga. I don't see a lot of people collecting this, uh, I mean, the artwork's all right. The story's pretty good. I enjoy it, so that's really all that matters. A Girl on the Shore is by the guy who, or Magaka, who did um, Solonin. I haven't read either of them yet. I've heard great things. Uh, I sort of skimmed through this, honestly, and I saw some sex scenes. I don't I don't know what the hell this is, but um, definitely intriguing, so I may get into it eventually. Ajin won the six. Um... I like Aja. It's pretty good. Akami Ga Kill. Uh, awesome series. Also, a good manga series. The anime was good up to a point. But, yeah, it just... I don't know. The It just went its own route and started killing everybody that weren't actually dying, so... Arpeggio Blue Steel. Dropped. It just... It, it actually has pretty good artwork, honestly, but it's just not my cup of tea. Assassination Classroom 1 to 6. Um, I like it. I haven't got the the newest volume yet, but overall, I, it's definitely a good series. New take on Shonen Battle Manga. I like it. Attack on Titan, No Regrets, 1 and 2. This is complete. This is uh, Levi's backstory. If you're really into Attack on Titan, check it out. Um, it's not a must-read, though. It's just all right. It's only two volumes, so it's whatever. Attack on Titan, 1 to 17. 
Um, I like Attack on Titan. I need to catch up. I haven't read volumes 15, 16, and 17 yet. I don't know why. I I don't know. It's just not a priority. I know if I, once I start reading it, I'll be like, why did I stop reading this? But for now, it's just like, whatever. I, anime's coming out soon. Uh, so hopefully I'll get back into it. Bakuman won the 20. This is a new pickup. Well, not a new pickup, but a series that I've been trying to get into. Only read one volume of it. Um, it's a lot of dialogue. Uh, so eventually I'll get around to it. But for now, it's going to sit on the shelf. Berserk won the 16. My favorite manga of all time. I honestly say that the Golden Age arc is hands down the best arc in all of manga. It, it has to be. I don't know a, an arc that truly emotionally destroys you like uh, the Golden Age arc. So uh, honestly, I haven't gotten the rest of them. All I've gotten is this. If you're looking to get into Berserk, but you're sort of like, eh, it has a lot of volume, just get this. Just get, you know, 1 to 16. This is a good place to stop, in my opinion, but I want to read more. I just haven't yet, unfortunately. So, Bleach won the 4, and then we have the rest. Um, 5 to 25, 26 to 66. Um, Bleach is good. Eh, is good. It was shitty for a while, uh, right here. Th this, these five, these five right here, were shit. Killed the series. Just was not good. It should have ended right here. This is where Bleach should have ended. Honestly, after Eisen, it should have been done, and they just kept it going. And now they're sort of trying to like get it all back. So. I don't know what you want me to say. Bleach was good. It's coming back. It's not as good as it used to be. A lot of weird plot holes. Like it doesn't. It just sometimes doesn't make sense. But anyways, I like Bleach. I I not hating on it. I just think it should have ended. Blood Lad one two three four five six seven. Blood Lad was the first manga I ever bought. Um, it was a wee lad. Not really, but. Um, overall it's still one of my favorites um, always has it's one of the few series that I've actually read multiple times it's pretty good if you haven't checked it out um, Yen Press licenses it and overall I I really enjoy it so definitely check it out Blue Exorcist 1 to 13 um, I don't know for some reason Blue Exorcist is like alright it's not my favorite um, but I know people like it, and I'm not going to shit on it, so I like it. I haven't read the latest volumes yet, but I got this cover. I got this volume because it looked badass. I was like, what is this all about? So, yeah, I'll get around to it eventually. Batum won the 8. This is all I'm going to get, probably. Batum was really good. It was like a Battle Royale manga with grenades and shit. Um, I liked it. Can't complain. Uh, yeah, it was all right. Cage of Eden, 1 to 19. This is technically Japan's version of Lost. I've stated this before. If you're a fan of Lost, definitely check this one out. Um, it's just a bunch of high schoolers. It's a little etchy, though. Um, it's it's a little etchy, but if you can get past that, it's a decent story. Um, yeah, definitely check it out. Uh, this is an illustration book of um, Claymore. Can't really open it because there's just a bunch of naked chicks, I guess. But Claymore, one to twenty-seven. I haven't read this. I really want to. I just got the box set not too long ago. Um, probably the next series I'll start up because I've heard a, a bunch of good stuff about it and I'm really interested. So Death Note, one to twelve. I don't need to talk about Death Note. You need to read it. You've already read it. I don't need to talk about it. Um, all right. Now I'm, now I'm down to the bottom half of the shelves, and we're 20 minutes in. Uh, <laughs> this may go 35 minutes, hopefully not. I'm, I want to keep it short. Uh, Dead Man Wonderland won the 13. Uh, finished finally. Uh, I'm about right here. I'm about to reread it though. I want to, I want to just get it out of the way. It's pretty good. Uh, I like it. Can't complain. Defrag won the four. Probably a lot of people don't know about Defrag. Defrag is really freaking hilarious. Uh, definitely check it out. 
there's like seven volumes out. I just haven't gotten the rest. Um, if you want a, a laugh, this is the manga to do it. This manga is hilarious. Uh, D. Grayman won the 15. I honestly did not like this series. Um, I'm not a fan. I know why people like it. Uh, but the dark, the dark, almost emo-like character design is just not for me. Um, I just wasn't a fan. It's, it's just my, not my cup of tea. Dragon R Academy won the four. Ugh. I don't know. This is like etchy I don't like. Uh... I don't like this kind of etchy, so I I stopped collecting that. Uh, do ra 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 or dur. Uh, won the four, won the three, won the two. I need the last uh, volume of Yellow Scarves. But overall, dur is pretty good. I can't complain. I've never... Yeah, it's, it's, it's all right. Eden, It's an Endless World. Won the 14. I'm really happy I got this series. Uh, this is why you need to search Craigslist your local Craigslist to find manga on sale you will not always find a hit uh, but when you do you will find good good stuff for very cheap I got one the 14 for 25 bucks so two dollars a volume uh, this volume alone is like 150 bucks so honestly check Craigslist you'll definitely find good deals sometimes not all the time because manga is still a niche uh, niche market so when you find something you'll definitely get a good deal evergreen won the two by the um manga who did golden time toradora etc a little darker than usual but still good four volumes are out it's complete haven't got the rest of it just i don't know not really on my focus fairy tale won the 52 yeah won the 52 um i enjoy fairy tale i know some people don't because of the fan service, um, I don't mind fan. Honestly, I don't care for like I don't mind it. It just it's there. It doesn't bother me. Um, it's still good. Last two arcs in Fairy Tale were pretty good. Can't wait for more. Um, but you know what? I can't complain. It's one of the first Shonen series I actually started collecting, so um, I like it. Food Wars won the ten. Awesome series. I forgot to do that. I mentioned this in my honorable, uh, my top 20. I really enjoy Food Wars. It was a little bit etchy at the beginning, but it's actually toned down quite a bit. It's not really as etchy as it used to be, which is, you know what? I respect it. Um, overall, definitely, definitely check this one out. Um, From the New World, won the seven complete, licensed by Vertical. This is like a Yuri horror adventure manga. It's very weird and different, um, but. If you uh, like Yuri and Horror, definitely check this one out. Freezing won the volumes 1, the 2, and 3, and 4. Uh, Freezing's pretty good. Uh, the manga is definitely very popular in Japan. It has multiple chapters and, and stuff, so they're finally being released here. I think volumes uh, 7 and 8 were just released. Um, but like I said, Freezing, can't complain. Uh, we're going to talk a, a series that I love and hate so much is a uh, full metal alchemist won the 27 complete in these shitty ass three in ones by viz don't ever buy these people if you're if you're a collector don't buy them um they're shit these are two in ones and they're thicker than these three in ones these things have 500 and something pages in them and it's literally like turning dust like I turned the page, like I just turned the page and it ripped. They're not worth it. Obviously, if you just want to re read a series, this is the way to go. But if you're trying to collect, definitely do not do these three in ones. They're shit, in my opinion. Uh, I'm really thinking about getting the full set in singles, and then I may give these away. Um, I'll pro if I if I when I do, I'll probably give these away uh, to a subscriber. Obviously not right now because I haven't got the series. But once I do, I will probably give these away because these are shit. So stay tuned for that. Um, next we have Gokin Police Day. This is um, another Yuri, very short Yuri, by the uh, manga who did Girlfriends. Um, yeah, and if you like Yuri, I try to support any any Yuri series that come out. I try to support it. Um, who doesn't want more Yuri? 
Gantz won the 10, and then a few sporadic volumes, 17, 18, and 19 still wrapped up. Um, I know some of these are hard to find. Uh, I tr Lately, I've been getting into Gantz, just trying to get the volumes while they're still in. Some of them are still in print. Um, I like Gantz. It's pretty good. I read the first arc, won the 8. Uh, it was pretty good. Really good. Um, still only right here, but going to continue reading it. Check it out. I don't know if I'm going to get all 37 volumes, but we'll see. Girlfriend's Collection. This one and two. Uh, oh, fuck. That's not good. Anyways. Um, yeah, the first Yuri manga I ever read. Uh, can't complain. If, you, if you're looking to get into Yuri, definitely check this one out. Damn, I can't believe I just did that. Ugh. Um, Hagane won the 10. I like the covers. The spines are really cool. Uh, this is another funny series. I'm a real big fan of the anime. So, um, yeah, check this one out if you're looking for a laugh. The artwork's sort of badly drawn, in my opinion. It's not the best, but the story's pretty funny. So if you haven't even heard of this, definitely watch the anime or check out the manga. Haven't you heard? I'm Sakamoto. Um, this is a pretty cool series. Sakamoto is a cool guy. He literally does everything cool. If you're looking for a cool guy, Sakamoto is the guy. High School DxD won the six. Honestly, I haven't even read past volume four. Yeah, I because I've only seen the first season. I only read these four volumes. Um, probably won't get it anymore. But overall, just it's just edgy stuff. High School of the Dead won the seven. Um, still on hiatus. Probably will always be on hiatus. Uh, while the manga or the at least the art illustrator is doing triage X. Um, but yeah, I, I miss High School of the Dead. It's not too bad. If you miss it, definitely check out Triage X. Higurashi, When They Cry, I only have six volumes of it. Um, yeah, it's alright. If you're looking for Twisted Horror, definitely check that one out. Hunter x Hunter or Hunter x Hunter, one to four. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm trying. Guys, I'm trying to get into the series. Um, but honestly, when the guy keeps going on hiatus all the time... It makes me not want to like dive into the series as quickly as possible because what happens if I if I turn out I real because I really like shonen battle manga I really do so if I end up liking this series and then I'm always like it's always on hiatus I I, I don't know I don't know how I'm gonna feel so I'm gonna take it slow I got four volumes of it I'll definitely get a few more soon is this a zombie volumes one to eight this is complete eh, just your it's a comedy harem manga it's pretty good and it, just check it out uh if you're into harems and comedy jojo's bizarre adventure part three volume one i just got it because the cover was pretty cool hopefully they release the hard covers of these uh with the su success of uh the first two parts but i'm not holding my breath uh kizu monogatari everyone needs this light novel everyone needs it this is monogatari please go get this Hopefully they bring over all the Monogatari series because that that shit's the best. Uh, Knights of Sindodia won the three. Uh, it's like Space Attack on Titan. Haven't read it yet. Uh, I'll get around to it. Sorry about that. Kokoro Connect won the five. Manga was pretty decent. Haven't read watched the anime. Probably should watch the anime. Manga was all right. Can't complain. Living Stone. I have no idea what this is about. Volume two is just re released. Uh, it sort of looks like a comic book, but it's manga. I, uh, I'll get around. I have a lot to get around to. Love Hina won the 14 complete. Um, yeah, Love Hina's pretty good. Well, was pretty good to me. Like, I, re I got these two volumes and I read them, like, really quickly. I'm like, holy shit, this is amazing. Um... And then I was like getting into this and I was like, oh, this is just so dumb. I, it, it's like that ass pull harem stuff. It's, ugh, I don't know. I couldn't do it. Uh, we'll talk more about this ass pull harem stuff coming up soon for sure. I know that for a fact. Uh, Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer 1 and 2. This is a good manga. The last volume was just released. There's only 10 volumes, so only five of these omnibuses. I need to get them. Uh, and read it because I know it's a good series. Magi won the 16, up to date. Um, 
I like Moggy. Moggy is really good. This is one of the series I regret judging by its cover. I looked at this volume and I was like, this is going to be shit. But I was wrong, and this series is one of my favorites. Definitely, definitely getting up there. The artwork's getting really sick, and I can't wait. Magical Girl Apocalypse 1 the 6. Now, this series is a series I like talking about uh, because I give... I usually give uh, manga three volumes, that's my rule, and then I decide whether I want to drop it or not. Um, so I read these three. Volumes one and two did not make a lick of sense, it was just ultra violent, ultra gory. And then there's a super plot twist at the end of this one and I was hooked. Like the plot twist was crazy and then I've been reading them ever since. It doesn't make sense. The story is great, absolutely ridiculous at times. but. Uh, I enjoy it, and definitely check it out if you're in the twisted, fucked up, magical girl horror, so. Okay, uh, Magico, the Swordsman, and the Summoner. This series is, I don't know what's going on with this series. Volume 2 is out of, like, print already. This series just came out not too long ago. It is etchy as fuck. Um, I don't, yeah, the cover is just, it's just really etchy. I don't really know much much about it. I think I did a recommendation video. I actually, I know I didn't. I was, but I decided not to. I don't know. Uh, if you can find it, go get it, I guess. Uh, Mayo Chicky 1 to 7 Complete. This is a harem that actually ends. I like this series. It's it's short. Harms should be short. They shouldn't be long and drawn out. Um, but yeah, I liked it. Definitely check it out. Marie and the Virgin Witch 1 and 2. Third volume's out. Haven't got it. Uh, there's only three volumes of it. Um, I don't know. Check it out. Uh, actually, I don't know. I, I don't know about that one, actually. So, do some research before you get it. Merman in my tub. I was... I, you know what? I just picked this one up just to pick it up. I knew what it was about. Um, but I was hoping it wasn't a four-panel manga. Like, it's just four panels, which... I don't like four panels. Uh, I wish it was an actual manga. I probably would have read it, but I'm not, I, I, I'm honestly not going to read it. It's four panels. I'm just not even going to touch it. Uh, Monster Masume 1 to 8. This is this is what a harem should be. Uh, I actually really enjoy this one. This is very etchy, though. Um, if you're not a fan of etchiness, don't, don't get this. Um, because there's a lot of fan service. Alright. Uh, another series that I recently got that I have no idea what it's about is MPD Psycho. I got this when I was getting um, Eden. I, the guy just had, you know, nine volumes of it and decided to pick it up. This is about a detective who has a split. He has multiple personality disorder and, like, he is a detective. He's also a killer, I guess. I don't know. I gotta check it out soon. Some of the volumes are out of print. I think there's only, like, 11 volumes there's only 11 volumes so it's there's not that much uh but i don't know i'm gonna check it out um do some research on it my hero academia won the three i really like this series super cool uh superhero manga can't wait for more my love story won the seven this now this is a shoujo i can get behind um where the main character is still a boy like i can read shoujo if it's a main character is a boy i for some reason i i can't get behind main girl like main character girls for some reason i don't know my little monster won the six uh, this is all i have this is all i plan on getting probably um it's whatever i it was all right but not my cup of tea my neighbor seki won the seven go get i don't this is the series i talk about the most this is the most underrated series you need to go get this this is hands down one of the funniest uh, manga I've ever read the anime is really funny and it's only seven minutes like they're seven minute volumes go check it out uh, but you're probably like based what are you doing seven minute episodes that waste my time you're wrong you are so wrong because this series is truly amazing definitely go check this one out and tell me why you don't like it uh, so yeah Naruto 28 to 72 I don't have the first part of Naruto just because I've read it like 20,000 times so uh, I'll eventually get it but Naruto I am a huge Naruto fanboy uh, I like Naruto better than One Piece but I think One Piece has the better story 
Um, I'm, you know, not like, yo, Naruto is way better than uh, One Piece. But honestly, I like Naruto more than One Piece. But I still like One Piece story. I think One Piece overall is a better manga. So, sorry. Uh, but that's just how I feel. I don't, you know, want to step on anybody's toes. Naruto, sad it ended. Can't wait for Boruto. Uh, Naruto Kakashi Story. This is a light novel featuring Kakashi as Hokage. I'll read it eventually. I'm a huge fan of Kakashi, so um, I'll definitely check it out. Ninja Slayer Kills. This is, uh, I don't know, sort of weird. Just a bunch of, fi it's literally fighting. Like, there's no story. It's just a bunch of fighting. I don't know. I'll, I don't know if you're just into it. There you go. Nisekoi. Now, this is what I talk about. Asphalt Harams. Nisekoi is good. It's not that good, though. Um, it needs to end. There's too many characters. It's not enjoyable to read anymore. I haven't read the last two volumes. Um, I'm still going to pick it up. I still think it's a good manga. I'm just not really head over here as like I used to be. So, No Game, No Life. This is the manga. I literally think this is like, I don't know what the fuck happened. This is the manga version of it. And then they like stopped making it because the light novels came out. So not much to say about that. Uh, no longer human one and two. I need volume three. I'm so I'm pretty salty, honestly, because I can't find it and I'm not paying eighty bucks for it. So yeah, that sucks. Uh, no matter how I look at it, it's your guys' fault. Not popular, better known as Wada Mote. Um, just awkward girl doing awkward things. It's pretty cringy, but you know what? I it's, it's sometimes it's actually really funny. So uh, if you're into that kind of stuff, check it out. Noragami won the 12. Um, <laughs> I hate to say it, guys, but I haven't read this series at all. I still get it every single month when it comes out because I know when I it's it's amazing. I've read I watched the anime. I'll eventually get around to reading this, um, but for now it just stays on the shelf. Nozaki Kun. This is another shojo title, but I'm pretty sure this is another fucking four panel manga series that I don't have any interest in. Anime was really good. I don't like four panel stuff. It's just not what I like to read. So, um, Omamara Hamari won the twelve. This is another harem, um, etchy harem. Mm, it's supernatural. It's pretty decent. It, it, it's a harem. What do you expect? It's it's okay. Uh, One Piece one two seventy seven. It's the rest of it over there, and then the remainder. Damn, I'm like laying on my side now. This is this is a struggle. All right, one to seventy-seven. I talked about one uh, one piece in my last collection video. Like I rode the Naruto dick for so long and refused to pick this up because I was a loyal Naruto fanboy. But then I realized that I needed to stop thinking that like that and pick up One Piece. And I read like One Piece in its entirety, and like. That's literally all I did for like two weeks. So, um, yeah, One Piece is so good. I really enjoy it. Granted, the last, the, the Fishman Island arc and the Punk Hazard arc were not very good. And if someone tries to say they are, we can talk about it. But honestly, it's they sucked. Dressrosa went on way too long. And the New World has not proven to be all that great. But, um... I still read it. I still think it's good. It's not going to be, obviously, the best arcs ever, so. One Punch Man won the five. Everyone now knows about One Punch Man. We don't need to talk about it. Uh, some Japanese versions of One Punch Man. Orange? No idea what this is about, though I know it's very popular, and uh, I'll read it eventually. Um, Pandora and the Crimson Shell won. I did a... I think I did a recommendation. This is the guy who did, like, a ghost in the shell. Um, but it's, like, a lollies and girls. It's really weird, so I didn't get the rest of it. Parasite won the eight. Um, I like Parasite. Good, really good series. Can't complain. Pipo Chu won the three um, by an American manga who went over to Japan and published his series in an adult Japanese magazine pretty good uh, it's only three volumes long I do not recommend picking up one volume get all three and read through it it's pretty out there crazy and bloody and sexual so prophecy one the three is complete it's like death note almost it's just about a guy who 
is trying to better the world, I guess. A, a group of guys trying to better the world. Siren won the 16. This is a really good series besides Volume 16. Um, the ending just sucked, in my opinion. Uh, but Volumes 1 to 15 is really good. Definitely, It's like almost like a Bleach. It reminds me of Bleach a little bit. So uh, it's pretty good. Check it out. Uh, Rose Gun Days. Uh, it's, it's sort of like Gangsta, but a little bit more uh, Shonen-y. Uh, I like it. Pretty good. Uh, Rosarium Vampire won the 24. Uh, honestly, if you've only seen Rosarium Vampire anime and you're going to judge it off the anime, you're completely wrong because the anime literally covers like these two volumes and that's it and just it's a bunch of fluff there is still is so much more it's actually really cool uh it's not where like skune is saved by mocha every single time it's more the other way around actually where skune saves mocha most of the time so it's pretty good uh Sankarea, 1 to 11 this is a series i do not see in a lot of people's collections that i think they should get this is a romantic comedy about a boy who resurrects a zombie uh, only 11 volumes. It's pretty good. Um, I did a recommendation video on it somewhere. I think it's like one of the first ones I did. Um, check it out. It's pretty good. Uh, I, I really enjoyed it. Um, Senron Kagura. Now, this is the worst manga in my whole fucking collection. Um, nope, that's not it. Yeah, this, this is the shittiest manga I own. Uh, there's three, third volumes out. I, this is not even a story. I don't even know. Like, I read it and it's like, random i don't i don't know it's just don't get it it's it's terrible yeah, and i'm sorry if it's your favorite manga of all time but your taste is terrible seraph of the end won the eight now this series is unlike senron kagura this series is amazing um plot twists everywhere so good it is phenomenal can't can't wait for more it's so good the seven deadly sins won the 12 no wonder this series is one of the highest selling series in japan it is so good can't wait for more so i can't play h i did a first impression video of this it's just a etchy fan service manga there's like four volumes out i just haven't got the rest soul eater won the 25 soul eater is one of my favorite oh fuck i forgot to put soul eater in my top actually no i didn't that's a bullshit i think i did i hope i did um i'll have to actually go back and check uh, but yeah, Soul Eater is really good. It's one of the few series that starts off, like you can tell in the artwork, that it's sort of shoddy at first. But then as it continues, the artwork gets actually really freaking good and more dark. It actually turns into a seinen after a while. So definitely check it out. Uh, I, I really like it. Uh, I think everyone should. Soul Eater, not some... It's just a spinoff shoujo yuri band, like, moe fan service knockoff, so... Yep, Sundome. Um, this is some weird stuff, but supposedly really good. I need to get the rest of it. Um, but yeah, and then the last volumes of Spice and Wolf, won the seven. All right, this video went on longer than it should have, but I don't know. Um, yeah. All right, so I don't know if this is gonna be the final cut or not. Um, but I'm, I may actually, I don't want to redo this video, but I may just because it's 43 minutes, but if it's not, oh, well, this is what you guys get. Um, 1200 volumes. Um, yeah, uh, can't wait this year. There's a bunch of stuff coming out. Haiku, Kuroko's Basketball, Black Clover, a ton of other shit that's coming out that I'm really excited for. Um, I really appreciate it, guys. 1000 subscribers is huge to me. I Honestly, when I started my channel a year ago, I thought I'd get, I thought 100 script subscribers was like maybe possible, but 1,000 is ridiculous. Um, so here's to uh, more manga and more good times, guys. So uh, I'll have more videos out uh, soon. So yeah, thank you very much. This is Bay Senpai. This is my awesome collection. So yeah, thank you very much.